Africa will be one of the most seriously affected continents when it comes to climate change. We need to transform the global industry of wildlife and environmental filmmaking. I'm Paula Kuhumbu. I'm an ecologist and I'm the CEO of Wildlife Direct, a conservation organization based in Nairobi, Kenya. I grew up just south of the city of Nairobi, privileged to have wildlife all around me, birds and monkeys and other creatures. It didn't just give me a sense of awe and wonder, it also gave me a sense of duty to protect this incredible landscape that I live in. Africa has been the home to so many blockbuster movies about our animals. All of the National Geographic, BBC, Disney, uh, Animal Planet films that are made here are not made for African audiences. They're actually made for international audiences, especially in the global north. And that means that African television channels remain devoid of wildlife content. There's no content in our local languages. There's no content about our traditions our history, our culture, and our attachment to nature. And all of these could play such an important role in reconnecting our people to nature so that they will defend it and protect it. There are hundreds of Africans who want to be involved in wildlife filmmaking and nature filmmaking, and they can't. They haven't got the training, they haven't got the equipment, and they haven't got the funds to allow them to go into the wilderness and make these films. The way that the whole industry is structured is actually not helping Africa very much at all. So I decided to make my own television series. It's called Wildlife Warriors. And this show aims to shine a light on those great conservation heroes at the front line, the Kenyans who are studying animals, saving animals, inspiring young Kenyans to care about nature. Imagine if all of the international filmmakers who come to the continent, partner with, collaborate with, support, train, assist African filmmakers to tell their own wildlife stories to our own audiences, to inspire people to love and care about nature. We cannot continue going the way we've been going. We are facing an extinction crisis. Already, we're seeing desertification, animals dying from thirst and hunger, and human conflict, people killing each other over access to water. on the executives of all of the wildlife and environmental filmmaking organizations to work with us to transform this industry, to support the development of the leadership that we need in Africa, South America, and Asia. We now have an incredible opportunity to turn things around. Can you see any animals? We really need to engage these partnerships and get to work immediately.